Hey guys, Erica here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. What is good y'all? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, turn on your post notifications so you can be updated as to every new video that I upload. Also, like, comment, and also share. Follow me on Instagram at unique underscore Erica underscore so you can see all my pictures for the different looks that I have created. So now in today's video, I'll be showing you guys a creative look that I came up with, showing you guys the in-depth how I do it and you know yeah so let's get into it so right now i'm just concealing my underbrow i'm making sure that the concealer is set i use the p louise base rumor one and also i'm using the la girl pro matte foundation now guys i made a mistake and i messed up my brows a bit so you all know that when you mess up your brows you can go back in right so right now i'm just patting that concealer in seamlessly because you know you have to get off all the excess product off your eyelid and making sure that as you apply the shadow that it's not gonna crease it's not gonna look nasty or funky you know what i'm saying as i set my eyes with the la girl nudist eyeshadow palette i'm now going in with the revlon liquid liner to line my eyelid now guys when i say i'm obsessed with the revlon liquid liner i am literally obsessed with it i use it 24 7 for every look that i do I am now going in with a neon pigment eyeliner water activated that is and when I say I am obsessed with these neon activated water body paints I am obsessed with it I know I'm always saying I'm obsessed with everything but yeah I am obsessed with everything yeah don't worry I'm gonna leave everything down in the description box so you guys can locate everything I got these neon colors on Amazon and they are to die for oh y'all know your girl coming back with the tape I'm coming back with the tape so now I'm using this tape to create this line. Well, the style that I have in mind, I needed tape. But unfortunately, I had to take that tape off because I'm here like, nah, sis, this thing messed up my brow, so I gotta do it again. So as you can see, I'm actually applying another set of tape, now activating my neon body paint. So right now I'm just rubbing that in, stirring that in, and getting ready to apply it on my forehead. So yeah, when I started applying it on my forehead, I realized it was dripping through the tape like I think I activated it too much because it's not supposed to be activated too much by using a lot of water so now I'm taking off the tape I'm, I'm here like god damn please don't drop on my brows please don't drop on my brows my brows ain't about to mess up not today not forever no period so I'm here like okay let me paint freehandedly because I'm not about to use the tape again and it messes up my face because i'm here like this look gotta come up good this this look gotta come up perfect like what you mean let me tell you guys let me tell you when it comes to my nose i'm very ticklish i don't know why i don't know who else is like this but I'm very ticklish when it comes to my nose and painting my nose here I was jiggling I was like oh my gosh yeah guys we're just going in we're going in we're digging in with that paint and fanning it down so it can dry all right now I'm going in with my foundation my Maybelline Superstay 30 hour foundation so I'm using the foundation to you know create a straight line and cleaning up any mistake that i made with that paint and it was quite hard but we did it we really did it we're going in and creating those lines and making it crisp sharp and neat <laughs> So next up, I'm just going in with an angle brush and making sure that every excess foundation has been patted off and is off my face, dry as possible. You know what I'm saying? Right now, I'm going in with the LA Girl Pro Matte Concealer and making sure that my under eye is concealed. Y'all realize I have paint on my face and 
I'm still concealing. Cause you know, makeup, you still have to conceal it. Your eyes still gotta pop. And one thing about concealing all of my eyes, it hurts. Like this thing went in my eyes. I'm here like, what? Now going in with the loose powder to set on in my eye is the Sasha Cosmetics Buttercup Powder. When I say I am in love with this powder, I am in love with it. For me, this is the fun part about doing this makeup look. I am now going in with this black body paint that I got from Amazon also. Yeah, girl. Yes. You can buy products from Amazon, makeup products that is, and they are good. So right now, I'm just applying some nice black spots to my face. You know, nothing perfect. It doesn't have to be perfect. You know, you're just applying it for the style. Now going in with a Pillow Louise base in Roma 1, I'm just applying that and outlining my lips to make sure that these colors are popping. For this style, I was planning on doing a matte look, but unfortunately, I didn't like how the colors were coming out. So obviously, and of course, we had to go in with gloss. Gloss makes everything work out. So right now, I'm just outlining my lips and making sure that my lips are glossy, nice, and sexy. Yeah, 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 we're almost finished. Now going in with this nice pigmented black eyeshadow and also applying this nice pink shade from the Fruits Cosmetics palette underneath my eyes. So going in with these nice pink rhinestones under the eyes to make it pop more and add in bottom lashes of course because what you're doing without bottom lashes girl. When I say bottom lashes makes your eyes pop more it makes your eyes. Of course applying your lashes and setting spray and making that look good like guys this is the finished product i'm here like come on girl let's see that in low light 